Welcome everybody to this edition of Attention Talk Video. I'm your host, ADHD and Attention Coach, Jeff Copper. Today, uh, I'm here to talk about ADHD in, in returns. Uh, but before we get into our content, um, uh, really just wanna make you aware that children and adults with Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, better known as CHAD, is a, a place to go to find evidence-based and evidence-informed information on ADHD. Just go to chadd.org. Okay, so here's the thing, uh, returns. Uh, you go buy something at the store, uh, you gotta remember where this receipt is, you gotta keep track of the receipt, and you gotta go back to the store to take it back uh, if you don't need it or can't use it. Um, that's a big problem. Uh, a lot of people with ADHD think, well, I should take that back. Uh, but I coach a lot of them, they don't actually ever take it back um, for decades. And they get lost in what they think they should do as opposed to what they'll actually do. Um, Self-awareness is really, really important right now because if you typically don't do that, then when you're at the store, notice if you buy it, it's probably going to be yours uh, because you'll have some difficulty tr keeping track of the receipt or finding the receipt and or finding the time to return it. I know years ago, I was reluctant um, to sign up for Amazon Prime, not because of the convenience for the ordering, but because it was a challenge to return the item. Now it's great. Um, uh, I can just take the item back to the UPS store where my work uh, mailbox is at and just walk in and give it to them. Um, just print off the receipt and be done. Whereas years ago, I didn't do that. I would order online from Walmart or Home Depot uh, because I could order that online and I could just take it back into whatever store uh, that's around without having to go through any types of gyrations, finding a box label, et cetera. What's my point? My point is this, if you've got ADHD, um, and this is speaking to you, you, then really what I encourage you to do is kind of like go what you think you should do. Uh, you might have, there might be a, done a bunch of stuff that you think you should do that you haven't done, except what you will do. And when you're in the store, pause for a moment and think, hmm, do I really need this? Um, or if I do need this, what are the chances of me coming back? If you do take it home, I encourage you, point of performance, try to take it back that day, like drive, get it, take it home and take it back. The chances that you'll return it as you get away from the point of purchase dwindles of substantially over time. So I hope uh, this gives you pause to think, create some awareness and to self-regulate. Um, for those watching for the first time, please subscribe to our channel. Uh, we love your um, subscribers and support of our channel. Also, please leave comments. Does this make sense? Do you have any other tips, tricks or strategies for the rest of our crowd? We always love the comments. Always makes for great uh, new show ideas. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed this edition of Attention Talk Video. Take care.